Where are we off to today, Mark? We are off to Tallahassee, Florida. We're leaving this wonderful poolside manor that we've been at. We're up at Tallahassee to uh, Fifth Tap Room, Fifth Street Tap Room. Fifth Avenue, bro. Fifth Avenue Tap Room, something like that. New place for us, but looking forward to it. So, what was your uh, your adventure today? Well, I made a uh, villages movie for Jody to show her the charm of Florida's friendliest hometown. Um, even though technically it's nobody's hometown because nobody's from here and nobody ever will be since there are no children allowed. <laughs> you can't explain that. You can't explain that. <laughs> I also saw a golf cart for sale for like $10,000 and then just down the street a Mitsubishi convertible for 9999 So, Wow. What you bought? Gives you an indication as to the uh, priorities. I guess so. Right here. But when I was walking back, I stopped at this <clears throat> look at this lake, and there were three three alligators in it. One was kind of a little guy, sort of swimming around, and then um, another one was a really big one over on the other side of the water, just kind of basking on the shoreline. And there was one of these big cranes. I forget what they're called. The sand. Sandhill cranes. Sand I think that's right. Sandhill cranes. Sand yeah. Hill cranes, who for some reason seem to be walking towards the bigger gator. Um, started out probably about 15 feet away from it, and ended up settling about five feet away from this thing. Um, and then meanwhile, this duck comes flying down and lands in the water right by this little gator, who within a minute lunges for it, and um, this thing takes off freaked. The crane sees this, you know, and starts squawking, and then within like seconds, every bird around the around the water took off. It's pretty exciting. Wow. Yeah. So that was your National Geographic moment of the day? <laughs> and then I killed a guy. Which is, you know. <laughs> As you do. Par for the course, really. <laughs> With a trident. Carl. <laughs> It's pretty incredible. Every hour. And we're o'clock again. Uh, we are in the uh, the offices of a real estate agent, our property assessment company in Tallahassee. 
Yeah, doing what? This doing chips. What else do you do in real estate offices? So you make chips and sells them. Cool. He does real estate oh, as does Glenn. Oh. Here's hoping the bubble doesn't burst soon. It won't. All right. Cool. I can't buy a house, but I can eat chips. All right. Fair enough. We're all waiting for it. What are you going to say? What am I going to say? <laughs> I'm going to say, if anyone's going to be rude, stop that. It's, it's illegal. Don't be rude. Cut it out. Don't, and it's, it's rude. Don't swear. Don't drink too much. Don't break the law. Because the law don't. wins. Yeah. Every time. Right. I stand corrected. I found that out when um, I I'm becoming a moralist. And the law won. <laughs> moralist. Yeah. No, from now on, no more rude things. No more swearing. Even thinking about doing You're what un you do. Uncomfortably close to me right now. <laughs> well, that's because the law is breathing down your neck. I don't know if I should slap you or kiss you right now. Either way, the camera's rolling, boys. <laughs> this video is going one direction or the other. <laughs> just, uh, just here to remind you that uh, today is not going to be, or shouldn't be, or wouldn't. <laughs> All right. Casual observer. Yeah, right. I'm gonna see what Trevor's up to because I'm afraid of you people. I'd say he's up to about three inches. Thanks, Trevor. <laughs>